So I was just thinking, I really need more caffeine. Ha! Ah! Ha! Ha! I got like this fuzziness going on and I, I realize it's, it's a, I think it's a, it's a caffeine thing. Maybe it's a water thing too, but whew, I got to get my, uh, my coffee maker. I gotta get another coffee maker because I broke my old one. This, this is like almost a daily thing. So much paper, like it just goes in my, goes in my mailbox, and then, then it goes right in my trash can. Anyway, this is maybe not quite fluid. Yeah. All right, so I am going to an audition uh, in West Hollywood. I gotta get there by three. My plan is I might just go and go there and get there early, or I might, uh, if I see a dollar store on the way, stop in and see if I can get a coffee press because I got my last coffee press for 99 cents, and it was a small one, but it was good enough to make some coffee. Uh, hopefully that'll work out. Oh, it's so warm in my car. It's warmer than it is in my house. So I'm going to kick my heater on soon, I think. Yeah. I don't know if it's worth talking about, um, but uh, this weather, it's like December 8th or something, 9th, 8th or 9th? Is it the 8th? I'm not sure. It's one of those two days. It was the 7th, two. It must be the 9th, right? I wish there would check. doesn't matter. It's, it's mid-December, and it's like... I mean, it's not like hot, it's like 60 or 70 degrees maybe, or 60 something, but like, look at the sky, dude. It's just beautiful. God, it's so warm. South, dude. I was raised in the north, you know? In Ohio, for most of my life. December meant cold, like, there was like, it's like when, it's like saying ball, and like, round. You, how how ba a ball implies round, that's how December implies cold in the north. But where I am now, it's like just, I mean, I appreciate it. I appreciate it almost every day. I try to appreciate it every day because it's so beautiful and it's so nice that, that I'm able to chill. I'm able to wear a t-shirt and a, a light jacket and, and take off and go around. I thought I'd share that with you, my appreciation. Also, I appreciate you, the viewer, and the responder, because your ideas and questions have kept me going and kept me interested in making videos and putting them on YouTube through all these years. Um, people were asking a little bit about what I do for a living, and uh, lately I've been collecting unemployment for, and um, auditioning and working on my album, which isn't coming along as fast as I'd like, but I've just, uh, yesterday picked up this program called Reason, which is fantastic. So now I need to get a new microphone. Once I get a new microphone, uh, it looks like the one I want to get is about 450. Um, I'll be able to really pound out some hot music. I've been working on that. Um, I picked up some shifts over at the restaurant, which I haven't worked at the restaurant in months. But uh, finances have been kind of tight, and uh, I figured I'd go there and we go bust some tables on Saturday. I'm so excited! I haven't bust table like I haven't bust tables in I think one day. I bust tables. That's why I'm pumped as shit, dude. I'm gonna be the busser, dude. It's like such a humbling experience. It's so much work, and it's so fun because you're like on such good terms with the waiters. It'll be cool to get back into that and, and get a taste of it again. Yeah. There's three big malls in Los Angeles, one of which is this. It's called the Beverly Center. Uh, well, I, I would say there's three. There's probably more than three. Uh, the Beverly Center is really cool. I like this. Uh, it's actually maybe the least cool of the three. The other one is the Glendale Galleria. And then the, my favorite is the Grove. Dude, the Grove. It's like an outdoor shopping mall. I'll definitely take you guys there. I like this glass uh, stairway escalation unit thing. Beverly Center's pretty cool. It's okay. It's kind of generic on the inside, but it's okay. 
this is a tough part about uh, parking. So you get stuff like this. No parking anytime. One R green permits exempt. So I gotta fucking find a parking spot. And I didn't see a 99 cent store. I thought there was one, it may be on Wilshire. Uh, Alright, let's rock this fucking Budweiser audition. I would take you in there with me. Except, I found businesses don't like recordings inside, but it, like, it doesn't matter. Like When I go to the grocery store, I'll turn the camera on and talk to the camera a little bit. But when I go to these auditions, like, because worst thing at the grocery stores are like, shut that camera off leave the grocery store and I'm like shit and then I go across the street to the other grocery store but like here it's kind of like a job interview so if I piss off the wrong people they'll stop calling me in so I gotta be real discreet about it but I'll see if I can get some footage of the inside of an audition room for you and I'll definitely show you the outside of the building god that sound do you see it? Running water? This is someone's house. I'm gonna live in a house like this one day. Or at least visit one regularly. I would love to have running water in my yard. And like a, a stone bridge over the running water. Or maybe like a wooden bridge, but I really like stone. And like a little pathway through a, a rock garden with running water and like waterfalls and shit. Maybe leading to a small swimming pool or a large swimming pool. And I would take it outside or inside. I have this fantasy of having like an indoor uh, pool with like waterfalls with glass window walls. Just glass all around that traps the heat and keeps it warm. Here we are. I know this building well. All these buildings, I get like these emotions when I come up on them. Get non stop action, dude. I wish I could show you guys these auditions from the inside. They're like dancing around, flipping burgers, drinking beer. The great, like, oh, it's strawberry. I think the one thing that would make me better at auditioning for beer commercials is getting drunk more. Like having being drunk, being part of my lifestyle. It's really cool. I'm back on the search for a coffee maker. Or maybe just some coffee. Is that okay? Well, so I'm gonna head up to David's up in North Hollywood. We're gonna meet up. And I know he's got coffee at his house, but I'm going to uh, keep my eyes open for a 99 cent store or something comparable. And hopefully I'll be able to pop in, grab myself a small coffee press. I mean, I could shell out the big bucks for like a nice coffee maker, but you know, just so that they, the 99 cent coffee makers exist is enough to make me want to get another one. It was nice, that audition, man. Anyway, uh, let's just talk about what's happening right now. I'm driving down Beverly Boulevard. I'm almost to Santa Monica. This intersection, see if you're in LA, if you're an LA person, this would look really common to you if you like spend time in West Hollywood. Now, I just got to David, so I'm gonna grab my shit, which consists of my guitar and my backpack and I'm gonna head up there and surprise him. What's up, man? Surprise! How's You're hunking good, man. Get some tea, dude. Some black chai tea with honey in it. It's hmm. freezing in this apartment. Do you have a heater? No. That's Trying awesome. to heat the kitchen with the oven. It's great, dude. Oh, is there more tea? Yeah, I can make some more. That's a great idea. Yeah. That looks so good.
Better than coffee. Natural caffeine, lots of flavor, herbs. Can't go wrong with herbs. Yes. Herbs, dude. All right, guys. I'm gonna wrap up the uh, the video blog for the day. We're getting ready to jam tonight, so hopefully I'll be able to get this up and on the internet by the time you guys uh, can see it. That doesn't make any sense. I don't know why I said it like that. Um, hopefully I'll get it up soon enough so that you can come meet us over on Stick Cam, and I'll post a link. Uh, and and if, you, if we're not jamming live, you're welcome to go check out some videos of our old jams. Um, probably see you tomorrow. Hey, one other thing I just thought of. Um, start checking my Facebook page because when we jam... The, the, the link is going to be from the Facebook page, not from YouTube. It's a real hassle to get a YouTube video uploaded, like a short one that's like, hey, we're on la la la. Um, and then sometimes I pull it down and it's like it tricks people and people might get subscriptions in their subscription box and then the video's not there and they're like, fuck this guy. So check Facebook, Twitter. Um, I'll post links to both of those and that'll be uh, your up-to-the-minute info on what we're doing. See ya.